Welcome to my gameplay on Life After, and today I'm going to show you how I hunt hares or rabbits. Um, this is a new thing that they've just included in the last update on the 25th of uh, March 2021. Okay, you need to have um, rabbit baits, which is um, something that you can quickly craft. You don't have to learn it. And um, also some carrots. Alright, so you're gonna have to look for holes and around the holes you should look for a good spot where you can deploy or stick your bait on the ground. So this one I found a good spot but it's quite far. I'm putting in um, the food and which is um, well they say carrots are the best so there's a higher chance of getting um, you know rabbits um, reach out for your bait so I can see a rabbit from afar you have to stay away from it while it's trying to get close to your bait so you stay away from it just not to scare it and it may go back to its hole and you might have to wait longer okay so now my bait got the rabbit it caught the rabbit I have to run to it and quickly get the um, the rabbit from the bait and put it in my bag make sure that I have a, um, a space in my bag all right so chuck in the rabbit rabbit there and and try to catch another one because I've got another bait waiting for another rabbit but um, yeah I think I have to put in another one just in case that's too far from the hole so yep once again I'm going to stay away from it and whilst waiting for the rabbit um, sometimes you're gonna have to look or watch out for the notifications that pop up on your screen that says you know rabbit activity around the area or something like that and that means there are rabbit holes that you have to look for and you can deploy your 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 baits around it okay sometimes it may take a while and sometimes you have to go around the map and just run around and do whatever okay and yeah so this is where the notifications um, pop up just in the middle the usual ones so you keep an eye on those yeah I'm trying to do something something else while waiting for the rabbit to come out okay so um, just standing from afar I can see the rabbit there it's trying to get closer to my bait and um, yeah just be a bit patient until it your bait catches it and then run to it and catch the rabbit right away because it you know it might escape all right so after getting some rabbits you have to also craft for a rabbit pen um, getting a rabbit pen is easy go to your materials machine and craft it from there it's automatic you don't have to learn the formula it's one of those things that you don't have to learn anymore um, so you just need hemp bricks and I believe wooden board um, this time um, I do not have enough bricks and I do not have enough lime to make bricks so I have to grab lime from the furniture shop and I might just get a stack of 20 just in case I would need some bricks crafted later on for something else or maybe for rabbit pens okay and they're really really cheap just new dollars like one um, one brick is just about 60 new dollars okay and just go back to the manor and just stick my lime somewhere in my storage it's a bit messy at the moment I'm going to I'm going to fix this later on I guess I don't know if it's ever gonna happen it's really hard when you're you know busy running every day it's just too much work to um, to consider when you're trying to to fix up your storage but it's best to fix your storage have it organized it's easier it's easier to look for stuff easier to chuck in some stuff and easier to to find what you want to sell or perhaps what you want to contribute or I mean yes donate to your vote okay so now I can create bricks and I can craft them for my rabbit pen 
So uh, creating bricks um, is pretty quick. It might take um, a minute. Depends how many you have to create. For the for my, for this one, it's just you know a few seconds, maybe 20 max. I just need three bricks this time. Okay. All right. So now that I have my bricks ready, I gotta have to create my rabbit pen finally. Yep. Wooden board, bricks, and hemp. All right. Now I have to look for a, sp a spot where I want to put in my rabbit pen. Okay. And rabbit pens are pretty tiny. They're tinier than the usual livestock pens. So you can st stick two rabbit pens um, together, or it's up to you how you want to arrange your farmland. Okay, so when you create your rabbit pen, of course, put in your rabbit in there and you can feed your rabbit whatever you you have available and that's it. And then you can harvest your rabbits later. You can use the furs for nanoplastic or um, you can also get meat, so tenderloin meat um, from your rabbit. And perhaps you can sell them as well in the market. Well, that's it for me. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Game over.